Hey friends, welcome to my channel and today we are going to talk lips. I am going to share with you my favorite um, lip products. It's basically the brands that I am loving. Um, I'll share with you the colors that I do love with these brands, but it's basically the brand and the formulas that I am loving. So if you like videos like this, go ahead and give it a big old thumbs up and subscribe and let's get started. The first brand I want to talk about is NYX. Now NYX is a product that I absolutely love. I love their blushes, I love their eyeshadows, I love their primers, but most importantly I love their lip glosses. Especially the butter glosses and the Mega Lip Shine. No, Mega Shine Lip Gloss. Now, these lip glosses are absolutely amazing, and I honestly think that you cannot find a better deal, better quality than these NYX products. I mean, they're absolutely stunning, and the pigmentation, oh goodness, the pigmentation. It is there. Everything is there. These suckers, you know, they don't get any better than these, especially the butter glosses. Now, during the summer, I am always wearing the butter glosses because of the pigmentation, how they make my lips look, how they make my lips feel, especially, you know, when you're outside during the summer, I mean, you're sweating, everything is, you know, it's hot, it's muggy, and to me, wearing these lip glosses, it never seems to fail. They don't, you know, they don't leave my lips. They keep my lips moisturized. Um, all I gotta do is just stick this in my pocket or stick it in my bag, go, you know, if I feel my lips are getting dry, I just, you know, put this on, don't need a mirror, and, you know, I'm good to go. They're absolutely stunning, and they're not matte, it's not shiny, it's not, you know, doesn't have little specks of glitter in them. It just makes your lips look, you know, their best. You just cannot get a better quality of a, you know, a gloss, especially a butter gloss, because I love butter lipsticks, you know, from Revlon and... Maybelline and L'Oreal. I mean, I love those, and I want to talk about those in a little bit, but lip gloss formula, absolutely stunning. And you know, and when I want to put a little bit of a shine to my lips, if I do have a lipstick on, and it's a little bit too matte, it's a little bit too drying on my lips, I just throw this sucker in there. And you know, I top the lipstick, and it is absolutely gorgeous. It says Mega Shine, but to me, it is not overly glossy. I mean, it's not going to be bam, all wet on your lips. I mean, your lips don't look wet, but they absolutely have the perfect amount of shine. I have it on right now, especially I have the color beige on, which I don't know why they call this beige, because it's not beige. It's pink. It's like a pinky nude or something. I mean, look at that. Absolutely gorgeous. It's not too shiny. To me, it is the perfect amount of shine that I want for my lips. And you know, I, I don't expect anything less from NYX. I mean, I really don't. Their products, you know, are especially gorgeous. I've, I have just recently, you know... I do have an opinion on this, but I only have one color, and it's the NYX Liquid Suede Lipsticks. This, I got the color in Cherry Skies. It's gorgeous. The color's gorgeous. But, I mean, it's not a matte liquid lipstick. It's not shiny either. It's kind of like, it's, it's kind of like your lips, but with a hint of a little tiny, tiny, tiny speck of gloss on it. So, I mean, it's not a drying formula at all, and it's gorgeous. I do love this, but not as much as I love the lip glosses from NYX. But these liquid suede lipsticks, if you want to start 
trying the liquid lipsticks and you're a little bit scared of them because they are truly pigmented and they can make a mess on your lips. I mean, to me, I've tried some liquid lipsticks and it was just, they're so intense and they're so a little bit terrifying. But to, the, to me, this is a good way to put your little toes into the liquid lipstick sands, if you know what I mean. Because it's easy to apply. It's not overpowering. It is, it's, it's a perfect, it's a perfect stepping stone if you want to get into liquid lipsticks. And if you want to stick to this, to this particular brand of liquid lipsticks, I mean, you can't go wrong because it's not going anywhere. I mean, just like the lip glosses, I mean, it, it takes a lot for this to go off your lips. And even at that, you're still going to see a hint of these colors. Talked about the butter glosses in the lips in the the lip glosses from NYX, but I do have to mention the lip butters from Revlon and L'Oreal and even Maybelline. These suckers are extremely nice. They're they really are nice, and they've got very good quality. They got good pigmentation. They've got an array of colors to choose from they really are perfect especially in the summer even in the winter if your lips feel a little bit dry a little bit cracked and you want some kind of color on them I mean yeah you can go for a chapstick that's got a hint of color but these they've got pigmentation they've got the buttery formula you know it's great I I couldn't go without having at least once, twice a week, wearing a lip butter lipstick from at least one of these brands. I mean, you can't go wrong. There's not one particular brand I love above the other because they all are, sorry if you can hear my puppy, he's dreamy. They all are great, great quality. I mean, everybody knows about these lip butters, but they don't talk about them anymore. I don't know why because they really are great quality and they're from and they're from the drugstore so I mean you can find them anywhere and why spend the money on getting a lip butter from you know a high-end place when you can just you can get these and they're great you know they you can't get them any better than if you just want a simple lip butter you know the drugstore's got them I think every brand's got them now for a little bit of a high-end market, I only have a couple because I'm a big drug drugstore lipstick hoarder, but I cannot get enough of these Too Faced Melted Liquid Lipsticks and the Buxom um, Lip Gloss, especially in the color Danny. I love this color, but we're going to talk about Too Faced first. Now these melted lipsticks that they've got, and I know they just came out with the matte formula. I'm not going to get the matte formula because I just don't like matte lipsticks. But the original, these are amazing. They do not make your lips feel overly um, trapped by lipsticks. It, it makes it feel comfortable. Pigmentation is there. I wouldn't expect anything else from Too Faced. Because I am in love with Too Faced. Their foundations, you know, their powder, their highlighter, eyeshadows, you know, pretty much everything from Too Faced I adore. But the melted lipsticks, awesome. And I know they are high end and they are a little bit expensive. But, you know, it's worth the money because their quality is there. Their, their pigmentations there, everything that you would want. And then they're really easy to apply apply because of their, their applicator is very nice, very easy to glide on the lips. I've got the co this color over as the lipstick. That's the base of my color right there, and I just put a little gloss over just to give it a little something-something. But, you know, I'm definitely going to go get the full size versions of these melted lipsticks because they're, they're great and they feel comfortable on the lips and that's really what I look for in any kind of lip product is how they make my lips feel. I mean I don't want something that's going to make me feel like I absolutely have something on my lips and if I talk 
it's going to start going through those little lines that you have on your lips. And this doesn't. I mean, it makes my lips look amazing. And I love them. And I absolutely love them. Now, this Buxom Lips that I've got, I really absolutely love this lip gloss for the color that I have because, and that's the reason why I am bringing this, I'm even talking about this Buxom Lips, is because I absolutely love the payoff that it has. I mean, as you can tell, it's just glossy. It's not shiny. It doesn't have sparkles in it. It's not matte. But it just gives your lips a little bit of a sheen to them. It makes them look younger, if you know what I mean. I mean, all these lip glosses can make your lips look younger. But to me, I don't know if it's the formula, but when I put this Buxom lip gloss, to me, it kind of, you know, it diminishes the look of the lines in your lips for some reason. I mean, it's, it's weird because it's not really the, I don't want to say it's, I don't know, something about this is kind of hard to explain. And it doesn't get talked about a lot. But I don't know if it's the formula or what it's got going on in there, but it really does help smooth out the lines in your lips. And to me, I love that. And it's the only reason why I would pay for the lip gloss. I mean, I know it's not terribly too expensive, but I mean, it does make your lips look younger. I mean, I guess that's what I'm trying to say. And also, with that in mind, I do have to tell y'all about the Lorac Lips with Benefit. This has got great pigmentation. It makes them feel moisturized. It makes them look plump. It's not a sticky formula, which I love. It is an awesome product. And it also makes the lips feel and look younger. But with this Lorac Lips with Benefits compared to this Buxom Lips, they're more pigmented. This is more of a gloss that you would just put over a lipstick, you know, and just that's it, just for a little gloss. This you can wear instead of your lipstick and just put this gloss on because it is pigmented as crap. I mean, it is, it is really pigmented and it's shiny. I mean, it's not too shiny. But you can see a little sparkle of glitter, I guess you can say. But... These suckers are absolutely stunning, and they stay on your lips forever, and that's what I love the most, especially, you know, I talked about how I only wear lip gloss in the summer, but this, I at least have one of the Lorac with Benefits lip glosses in my purse, just because I know when I feel that my lips are a little bit dry, and they need something, I just put this on, and it doesn't matter what I'm wearing, it looks amazing. I mean, and my lips feel instantly moist and hydrated. They look awesome, they look younger. You know, you just can't get better for a high-end, you know, for a lip gloss, to me, in my personal opinion, than this Lorac with Benefits. I mean, it's, it's great, and I've got a lot of colors. I think I've at least got five of them and I absolutely adore each and every one of them. There's not one color that I do not love. Well, that is all of my favorite lip products. I hope y'all enjoy the video. If there is any lip products that y'all absolutely love, leave them in the description bar and let me know because, you know, I'm always, I'm always willing to try new products, new formulas, because you never know, I might love them more than I love one of these products. So, I hope you enjoyed the video. If y'all did, give it a big old thumbs up and subscribe, and I will see y'all later. Bye, friends!